Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we have got this nested radical equation as you can see over here. Though this problem looks really complicated, but as a matter of fact, this is a really, really simple problem and I'll show you how to do it in just a few steps. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here I have copied this equation down over here as you can see. And now the very first thing I want to do is I want to isolate this radical part. So that means this negative 6 should go on the right hand side. And here as you can see I have just copied down square root of 38 minus the cube root of 7. And then within that cube root we got a fourth root of x equal to 6 and now as we can see we got a square root we want to undo this square root we are going to take the square on this side and likewise we are going to take the square on this side as well and as you can see that this square and square root they undo each other so we ended up with 38 minus the cube root of this 7 plus and then fourth root of x equal to 6 square is going to become 36 and now let's go ahead and move this 38 on the right hand side once we move that thing so that is going to give us the cube root of this 7 plus the fourth root of x equal to 36 minus 38 so we got the same thing on the left hand side on the right hand side we got just simply negative 2 now as you can see we got a negative signs on both sides so I can remove those negative signs by just dividing both sides by negative 1 and now on the right hand side you can see we no longer have a negative sign on both sides so we got on the left hand side the cube root of 7 plus fourth root of x equal to 2 and now we want to undo this cube root so therefore I am going to take the power 3 on both sides so as you can see this cube and cube root they are gone so we ended up with 7 plus the fourth root of x and we know 2 power 3 is 8 let's move this 7 on the right hand side so this is going to become fourth root of x equal to 8 minus 7 so therefore we got the fourth root of x equal to positive 1 and we are almost done now let's go ahead and remove this fourth root by taking the fourth power on both side so this fourth root and power 4 they undo each other so we ended up x equal to 1 power 4 means 1 and that is our solution so thus our solution turns out to be x equal to 1 thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye